Over the course of my life, I realized that writing has been extremely helpful to me to deal with different things that I've been going through. And I made up my mind to share this with you guys. And I was thinking that I'll share a poem that I wrote right after 9-11 that helped me to cope with everything that was going on. And I was thinking that the task would be to have you guys write about everything that was happening with the pandemic. And then of course, we were faced with the George Floyd situation. So I started thinking maybe I should write a poem about that. But unfortunately, it's something that is so personal to me every time I started trying to write about it. The words would flow and the tears would follow right behind it. So that's not something that I'm able to really write about or talk about right now. So I'm going to share my poem from 9-11, the poem that I wrote right after 9-11. And I'm going to challenge you guys to write about whatever is most powerful, most profound in your lives right now. And even if you decide not to share it because it's too personal, just the, the, the art of writing helps you to release the tension, the frustration that you might feel. Because basically, you are really living history right now. You are dealing with so many things. It, it is amazing. And just the fact that we all still standing, you guys at your age dealing with all these things, that, that says a lot about you, about your tenacity. And I just hope that you embrace the, the person that you are. So I'm going to share this poem with you. The title of the poem is The Eagle, the Eagle Shed a Tear. 9-11-2001, a day I won't forget, because from the skies before my eyes did roar a mighty jet. And as I stood there helplessly, for there was nothing I could do, it ripped into the heart and soul of the red, the white, and the blue. I stood in shock and disbelief, for there was nothing I could say, but ten times multiplied my grief, there was another on its way. Target one was standing tall, as if in defiance of the act. Its replica, hit twice as hard, still remained intact. They both stood tall, as if granting time for their occupants to flee. Then my heart and tower one did fall in synchronicity. A gentleman who was walking by said, They got us good, my friend. But have no fear, don't you despair. We will rebuild again. And though I am an optimist, my heart filled with despair, for as the walls came tumbling down, the eagle shed a tear. So once again, I wrote this after 9-11. I have a lot of emotions, a lot of feelings about what is going on right now. So eventually I will be able to actually put that to paper and hopefully it will help me to release all of the negative energy that I have inside of me. And I'm hoping that you guys could benefit from writing as well. So I'm challenging you to put pen to paper and express your feelings. If you decide to share it all well and good, hopefully at least you guys could find a way to release your feelings and communicate your emotions. So I'm looking forward to seeing, hearing, reading your work.